If you're looking to improve your breaststroke kick, this video is for you. Hey swimmers, welcome back to the Swim Bites channel. I'm Coach Mandy, and today's video is dedicated to breaststroke, specifically on the breaststroke kick. Now, before I get into detail, if you're new to this channel and you're looking to improve your swim training, be sure to subscribe to the channel as I post videos weekly. So in this video breakdown, I'm gonna demonstrate a couple of drills that you can do to help improve the actual dorsiflexion of your foot to overall improve your kick and where you can get the most power from your glutes, your hamstrings, and your quads. So let's get to the video breakdown to help you with your technique. Okay, so in this video, I'm gonna be demonstrating two different breaststroke kick drills. However, they are the same exact movement. There's only one difference. One demo is on your back and one demo is on your stomach. So both of them are very useful, but I'm first gonna start with the first demonstration, which will be on your stomach. And the two key points with this is that you're gonna have your arms extended on your back, and you're going to drive your heels up towards your palms. So your palms are going to be right above your bottom. You're going to drive your heels up, then turn your feet out and bring it full around. Squeeze your legs to feel that nice glide after each finished kick. I'm going to follow that with a second demonstration, which is the same position, but just on your back. And what you're going to do is you're going to drive the heels towards your bottom without lifting your knees out of the water. That's the key point is you want to keep your knees and your thighs parallel to the surface of the water completely. They don't break the surface because if you do, you end up bending at your waist too much and your body kind of collapses in and that defeats the purpose of the drill. Mind you for both demo one and demo two, most importantly, demo two, it's got to be comfortable on your back. This is more of an advanced drill. So uh, if you're not quite comfortable with on your back yet, you would want to practice demo one and you stop and you stand up to breathe. So this is only strictly for technique of the kick. And then I'm going to follow that with a third demonstration, which is just the full breaststroke. So you can see it in action and really where you, your feet turn out completely is on the finish of your breath. So it's not even when you're breathing, that's when you're driving the knee, the, sorry, your feet in. And when you finish the breath and you complete it fully as you move forward, that's where your feet are turned out to get the most power out of your kick. Okay, so here's the first demonstration. You're gonna push off the wall. You're gonna extend your arms slowly behind you with your palms facing up. You're gonna drive your heels in, turn your feet out and squeeze. And it's gonna go through this demonstration, slow down so you can see the exact sequence, but for now you can just see it all the way through. And you wanna stop and stand up to breathe. So right here, arms are gonna go fully extended with palms up. Drive your feet all the way back, then turn your feet out, bring them around, fully extend your legs close together so you get the most glide out of each kick. So it's really about getting that nice glide every time you finish through. And the more you practice this, the easier your glide's going to be as you move forward. Okay, on to demo two, I'm on my back. Arms will be extended with the palms facing the ground. You're gonna drive your heels back towards your hands, turn your feet out and squeeze. And the main thing is keeping your knees and your thighs parallel to the surface of the water. You're really trying not to break the surface. All right, the key is to keep everything in alignment, head position nice and relaxed, get your arms behind you and drive the heels all the way back, turn your feet out and squeeze. So you'll feel a nice glide as well on your back, but the main thing is, is it's forcing you to let go of breaking your knees from the surface and really actually just flex, having flexion in your hips. So it's forcing you to keep the legs back and get the most out of your breaststroke kick.
Okay, so here's it in full stroke. And you see that as I have it slowed down, you'll see that my feet turn out on the finish of the breath. But as they drive up, you think of heels come all the way up, drive the feet out when you finish the breath. So right at about here is where it happens. So your feet really turn out at this point where I have it freeze framed. And then after that, it just follows through back into a full extension with your legs. All right, swimmers, I hope you enjoyed those video demonstrations. And now you have some practice points you could take to the pool to work specifically on the kick. Now, if you have any questions, drop a comment below. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and click the links below in the description to help with your training. All right, swimmers, enjoy your practice, and I will see you all next week.